In this video, I use a heat press to prepare a shirt for applying heat transfer vinyl. But of course, you can also use a home iron. Just put it on high heat with no steam. And if you would, comment below and let me know what other kind of tutorials you'd like to see. And obviously, I'd love for you to like and share this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Hi guys, it's Deborah at Heat Transfer Source, and we're going to talk today about how to prepare a garment for um, HTV. And what you want to do before you apply any vinyl is to pre-press it to remove the wrinkles and the moisture because HTV won't stick if there's either of those things on the shirt or in the shirt. So what we're going to do first is just give it a general press. I have the side seams here uh, together and flat. So I'm going to give it one press that way. My heat press is set at 300 and I'm just going to press it for a couple of seconds just to make sure that's nice and flat and that side seam is together. And I'm going to do the same thing on this side. Now, we're going to press from the side seams across the chest. And you can do it right below the sleeves, right, before the, uh, right below the armpits. So this will give us another center line, our first one. Then we're going to find the other, the second center line, putting the shoulder seams together. Making sure also the side seams, we're just folding it in half and pressing it again. So we're keeping the bottom armpit seams together and the shoulder seams together. And that gives us two center lines. With an adult's t-shirt, and this is a size small in adults, here's the center line again. I think you can see it. You want to go about three inches below, I mean three fingers below the neckline. And that's about what that is. So that gives us the top of where, because this is a women's scooped neck, that's going to give us the top of where our image is going to go. All right. the sprinkle donut in a world full of plain bagels. Thanks everyone. Bye. For more tutorials like this, just subscribe to our YouTube channel and remember to hit the bell to be notified of all new tutorials. Thanks again everyone.